And another eight games are in the record books. And pulling up the standings, we have a three-way tie for first place now with Connor Logic Gaming, LMQ, and Dignitas. Such close standings. Cloud9 and TSM are also tied for fourth place, if you can believe it. Curse moved up a spot to take sixth and tied for last. It is still Complexity and Evil Genius. That's right. Now let's take a look at our Week 4 Dream Team with the players who went above and beyond. Starting in the top, it's Dyrus. He had a solid week four, only dying once and looking like the dominant player we saw in the spring split. Yeah, and in the jungle, another TSM player, amazing. Mm -hmm. He lived up to his name this week. He changed his play style substantially this week. He's been working on it for a while, but a very supportive jungle style gives him incredible KDA and also a 2-0 week for TSM. That's right, OP in the mid lane, it's Voiboy. He had a great game on Cassidy and took down the number one ranked LMQ. A lot of armor in that build for his tank Cassidy. <laughs> I've seen our 80 carry this week, of course, is double lift. He had two great games on that Twitch, racking up a lot of kills. The 17 to 11 doesn't yeah. really tell the whole story. He was carrying those games. It doesn't hurt either. Lemon Nation came up big on Thresh, landing three early game hooks and getting a little weak one payback by taking down Dignitas. But there is always only one captain of the ship, and this week the player who stood above the rest was amazing. Yeah, um, honestly, amazing show that he can play the support role jungler, and he ended the week with only one death in a 32 KDA. The big thing about this is he really changed his style. He's not yep. on the Copenhagen Wolves anymore, where he had to be the carry. Right. And to be able to come into a struggling team, take Lokodoka's advice, yep. become more of a supportive jungler, is absolutely huge. Rushing the session on the least, the entire team looked better, in large part because of the jungle pressure of Amazing. Absolutely. As a reminder, next week we are pulling a broadcast swap with our European counterparts as they take their show on the road, which means we'll be kicking off week five with the North American LCS on Thursday. Mark it down, starting with a brand new LCS preview show. Then Team Curse will take to the Rift against Cloud9. Followed by TSM versus Ticket Toss and LMQ taking on CLG. Big games all around, concluding the day with EG against Complexity. That's right. Then the European LCS will hit your browsers on Saturday from Wembley Arena. So mark your calendars. Week 5 gets underway Thursday at 11.30 a.m. Pacific Time, 8.30 Central European Summer Time. We're about to send it over to Freak and Zyrene to kick off the North American Challenger Series with a semifinal showdown featuring eight former NALCS players, yeah. including She 